Hi guys, this is another Lika problem called Find and Replace in String. To some string S, we will perform some replacement operation that replace groups of letters with new ones, not necessarily the same. Each replacement operation has three parameters, a study index I, a source word X, and a target word Y. The rule is, if X starts at position I in the original string S, then we will replace that current so X and Y, and X with Y. If not, we do nothing. For example, if we have S string equal to A, B, C, D, and we have some replacement operation I equal to 2, X equal to C, D, Y equal to F, 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 then because C, D starts at position 2 in the original string, we will replace it with F, 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 F. Okay, like for this example, A starts at 0, so we replace it with E, 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 and C, D starts at index 2, so we replace that with F, 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 so finally this is the result. Okay, so let's do that. We could have a hash map to store all the index. Like hash map index. And then we loop over the index indices array i plus plus. If we found that s substring starts at index of i, we get the substring starting from indices i. If that starts with starts with the substring that in the sources array, then we know we found a match. So 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 we know that the string starts from here needs to be replaced. So we could just put it in the hash map. The key will be indices of i. Value will be the i indices. So this i will be used to identify the substring in the source array and in the targets array. So after we have this hash map, we could have a string buffer. So finally, all the results will be stored in the string buffer. Finally, we can still return the string buffer to string. And then we need to loop over the, we could have i index i right here. Loop over the s original s string. If we if we found out that hash map contains key, if we found out it contains key of i, we will do some operation else. If we don't find it, then we copy the original character to the string buffer s.kl at of i and move with next character. But if we find it, we need to replace the substring with the new string in the targets. So what we could do is string append append the the targets and how and the value will be the i so what that what we could do is hash map dot get of i so we append the substring in the target array to the string buffer and I will move, just move the length of sources hash map dot gate of i dot length. So I will move these steps because we need to skip over the substring in the sources array. And I think that should work. Let me try. Okay, that worked. Uh, submit. Okay guys, that worked. So the idea is we put the indices mapping from source string S to the positions in the indices or sources or targets array. And then we loop over the S string again. 
if we found the substring needs to be replaced, then we get that from the target array, and I will move steps steps uh, the length of the of the substring in the sources array. Otherwise, we just copy the character from the original S string to the final string buffer and return that out. Let me know if you have a better solution. Thank you.